This morning, Grace woke me up because she hasn't slept all night and she said her belly hurt. She was very, very in pain. She's at the emergency right now. She's waiting uh, for the result because they had to do tests on her to figure out what it was. She was in extreme pain. She was on the floor. She was like, like she was not crying, but like she was like keep moaning and making noise. And like it did happen in the past. And every single time it's kind of very scary. So hopefully they'll figure out what it is. Hopefully it's not too bad. So it's March daybreak. I'm the lucky dad at home with the Packer right now. Yeah, they're having fun. Gab spent the whole morning on his Fortnite. Gab. Gab. What? You worried for your mom? Huh? You don't care. Are you worried for your mom? You don't care. No, I don't think she's like that bad. It's okay, right? Yeah, is she okay? Yeah, she's fine. Okay. I'm gonna go get her soon, okay? Are you having fun? Yep. Am I bothering you? Do you mind if I talk to you? Yeah. What? Am I bothering you? Yes, I just died because of you. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry, man. I couldn't build fast enough and then I died. The, the game started by itself and then I was AFK and then everybody was shooting at me. And you did not have a 100% concentration. No. Right. no, no. I'm sorry, man. Mim's in, his, in her room in the dark. Can I come in? No. Yep. I'm playing Roblox. You're playing Roblox? Yeah. Can I play Roblox or is it not allowed? Do you miss your mom? Yeah. Is she okay? I think she is we're not sure but uh, what is it I mean, we don't know she's they're passing test oh, okay. a later. maybe like a charla's on the phone or on the tv watching icarly or something like that sam cat charity what? what are you doing oh man uh -huh, you didn't do well are you worried for mama yeah yeah we're gonna go get her soon okay they call she called she said i can go get her if she messaged me on my phone you let me know okay Oh, look, I cleaned up some of the clothes. You did? Yeah. Good job, ma'am. Thanks, Papa. You can't stay in the dark, okay? Okay, open depressive. the light. Open the light. I'll open this too. Yeah. You're going to be depressed a little bit, okay? <laughs> you want to fly the drone later? Yeah. Because I got the second battery. Yeah. And I can't wait to go see Grace, see what she has. I'm a little bit worried, but we'll see, guys. We'll update you in a few hours. Meanwhile, we'll fly the drone with that, Gab. And I'm gonna try to push Mim to finish her room so she could clean her room. I think that would be great. I wanna go ice skating. Ice skating? We went last night. Most of us have like have like light paint right now because we went no, ice skating. I didn't. Don't you have friends? No. Maybe it's time for you to make friends. I haven't stopped since the morning since I dropped Grace at the emergency, so but it's time to go take a shower because she said that I smell like skunk. She said my ear smells like skunk. Oh, with the earbuds. So maybe the earbuds smell like skunk. Maybe not me. You think it's me or the earbuds? Earbuds. Okay, so she said the earbuds smells like skunk. Anyhow, I'm still gonna go take a shower because I haven't taken a shower since this morning. It's now 2 p.m. in the afternoon. I'm a big fat slob that smells like skunk. Grace is about to call back, so I made her get in the shower and get ready because you never know with those guys what's gonna happen next. Fight, screaming, hungry. To take a shower, guys. Oh, how about like this, guys? Sometimes I have message and Charlotte doesn't tell me. So, all right, so do we have, nope, email? Nope, because I'm waiting for stuff from Brigade because Grace is at the hospital, so she can't do stuff. So I'm asking our employee to do stuff for us. They're gonna mail me the stuff we need, which is actually the order for the food. Honestly, I'm gonna send back to her because I don't know how to do the order. She does it. <laughs> that is true. Hold a second, we got a comment. From YouTube? Yeah. The supper has a channel, they say, Thumbs up, guys. Well, thumbs up to you too, guys. Go see the supper channels. Have fun. I'm going to take a shower. What do you want me to download? You know, I'm doing something important here. All right, give me your hand. I'll give you a phone. Ew! <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful, delicious soap. That is lotion yeah. if you have dry skin. Yeah, well, then now you're not going to have dry skin. Mm. We have three girls in our house here and then we have seven bottles of shampoo, all different brand, different quantity of shampoo in there. Why is there so many of them? I mean, firstly, it's not Charlotte, it's probably Grace and Mim, but like men's are so much easier. They have like seven soap, eight bottles of shampoo, 
10 conditioner. Like I'm looking for my one tiny bottles and my small soap and I can't even find them. Like there's so much stuff in the shower. Uh, struggle of a dad, I suppose. Uh, Grace about to call. I heard that she has a sandwich at the hospital because she was really hungry. I offered to bring her food and she said, no, I had a sandwich from the vending machine. So she's fine. She slept there somewhere. I don't know on the floor <laughs> I have no idea so I can't wait to have her back home because I really miss her it's to be a couple hours but like I feel like she's in need of help like or comfort or something and I want to give it back to her so we're gonna work on that this afternoon with Grace but first I'm gonna go do some activities with the pack and now it's gonna go in the air so stay away a little bit as long as it doesn't fall on our face we should be okay I can see you guys Be careful for the tree too, huh? Always look at the drone because on the screen you might not see. On the screen you might not see things and you might hit them. Oops. Okay, there's no more. <laughs> all right guys, so that's all we can do. I have no idea what happened. It just got super cold all of a sudden. Wind come out of nowhere. Our hands are freezing, our face is frozen. I can't feel my finger right now. It's cool. Oh, I got the text from Grace. She's ready, it's done. They did all the tests, the x-ray. Uh, it's not what we thought it was gonna be. It's not an ulcer. It's a little more complicated than that. She's gonna need to have a surgery. Uh, very very soon so I'm gonna let her actually explain it to you a little more than that because I don't know exactly what it is so I'm gonna go get her with a pack so basically what we're gonna have to do guys is we're gonna have to eat a lot more vegetable from now on mm. steam vegetable healthier food I'm 198 pounds Why? it's too heavy anyway well because mama has to get a surgery anything is fine but you know we're gonna have to eat healthier food including you guys mm -hmm. so you're gonna get healthier less hot dog less burger less McDonald right so we're gonna have to eat healthy food yeah Roasted vegetables taste I'm sorry to tell you, they might even be steam, not even roasted. <laughs> because like this is the healthiest way to eat vegetable. There's two reasons why we want to eat healthier now. First, we're eating like crap. I'm 40 pounds overweight. You guys are growing with like that junk food is not good. And second of all, we need to support mama. Because mama's gonna have to eat smaller portion and she's gonna have to eat healthier food. No, God, please! You understand? No, no! She's so going no through something candy? difficult. So like it's not fair she has to eat like tiny portion. I'm eating a like, slice of pizzas. It's not nice to her either, no, right? So I think it goes both ways. It's actually gonna help us being healthier, smarter, okay, more well, energy. And also it's gonna support your mom going through that. Are we allowed to have a little bit candy? Yeah, yeah, we're not gonna go crazy. I mean, you guys wanna have a craft dinner once in a while, it's not the end of the world. Sorry. So we're not gonna fill the fridge with chicken nuggets and pizzas and then <laughs> the usual now it's gonna be like a little bit healthier you guys have to make a little part you're gonna have to be part of it she's waiting for us at hospital so So what happened was last night around eight o'clock, my stomach started to hurt and I thought it was heartburn. A lot of you mothers out there, I know like sometimes you guys just like have things that hurt and you just kind of like brush them off. Well, if when they start to hurt pretty bad, you should go to the hospital. <laughs> yeah. Last night when I went to bed, you were on the cow on the floor here. Mm -hmm. oh. It wasn't that bad though. Oh, it was bad. Oh, oh it yeah, was? yeah. You said, JD, it reminds me of the time that we had to call the ambulance. You went for tests and it was actually, they said it was no sleep. Yeah, so this has actually happened almost a, yeah. a year and a half ago. The exact same thing. And back then, they told me that it was probably an ulcer. They couldn't really tell. So they gave me some ulcer medication and like it was and it fine. Away, right? And like throughout the year, my stomach would hurt. Like it actually would come and go, but I always thought it was heartburn and I would take Tums. We have a whole bunch of Tums in our thing. So finally today, she's like, well, I'm gonna take an ultrasound, you know? She takes an ultrasound and she's like, oh, you got like, you're pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> no, you have gallstones. I have family members, Gall older stone? ones. Gall have them. Yeah, gallstones. I've had older family members have them and had to so, get gallstone for the one of you that don't know. Maybe it's it's stone in the gallbladder. The gallbladder generate acid that help you digest your food. Yeah. So now yeah. there's stone blocking yeah. it. It's filled up with little and stones, it makes your so. belly hurt once in a while like crazy. And yeah. So she kind of quickly said, uh, you gotta get it moved. I'm like, what? What are you, what are you saying? And then she, then she's like, yeah, just don't eat anything with fat in it until the surgery. Then she has like an assistant come in later to like 
give me a real appointment. So on Wednesday, I'm going to meet with the surgeon on Wednesday, really talk about the details of the surgery, what I can eat, what I can't eat. So I've, I've Googled some stuff, but like, yeah, comment down below if you had that experience because I'm not going to have a gallbladder anymore. <laughs> like pretty soon. Okay. She briefly told me that I could only eat small meals. Like I can't eat three big meals anymore. I can't eat huge meals, which I sometimes do enjoy eating gigantic meals. Like it's just fun, but I can't do any of that. I have to eat tiny meals throughout the whole day. No fat, no milk, no ice cream. And these are the things- Well, you already, you already hate so, milk. You don't drink milk. I know, but I am the hugest sweet tooth. I love chocolate. I love cookies and I love ice cream. So these are things that I'm kind of like, oh, I have to get rid of them because I really do. I can't eat them anymore or I have to eat. I just can't. So I think it's a good thing that we're all going to get a little healthier here. Yeah, like tonight. And it's going to be a good support for Grace. And it's good to know that now I want to use that as a motivation for the kid to understand that they have to eat vegetable. You know, like right now it's like I'm torturing them when I give them good food. So, so, so we're going to take you with, with us with this journey. We'll see where it goes. Oh, but, yeah. So like I, I think you have, to, I think you have to look at the positive side of everything. And I really do. I think I really always see a positive and there's a reason for this thing to happen to us. And, uh, and no, I'm saying happened to us. It's not a big deal. Like, let's be honest. It's not, oh my gosh, there's no drama going on here. Uh, but but yeah, I think there's always something deal. positive. Or at least, I, I, at least I, I like to think that there is. So. No, no, I, I really think that I want to support you. So I want to eat as good as you are. Am I going to fall off the wagon? I don't know. I'll try my best. So yeah. No cookie for you. <laughs> so uh, we'll keep you updated. We love you. Never give up. Let's get some stuff, guys. What is this? What is this? I don't know what this is. All the heads are cut off. Yeah. They're very intense with the fish. <laughs> Looks like a. Oh, these are these are flying fish. These are the fish that flies over the water. I think. Oh. Wait. Let me see. Let me see. They have tiny teeth. Wait. These are flying fish. No, no I think these are over there. This... They look like it. No. You know like the fish that flies over the water when they're oh, being yeah. when they're being chased. Do you guys want to eat fish? No. No. Why? Why? These ones are like sideways. <laughs> Look at their eyes. They're on top there. They're like sideways. Ew. You see their eyes? Yeah. You know, That's funny. It's called a fluke because they look like a fluke. <laughs> What's a fluke? <laughs> it's like a mistake. <laughs>